Game night. Date night. Tonight on Game Night Date Night, Nikki and Mia Lincoln are going to teach and try to play Dinner in Paris, a two to four player game designed by Les Trolls Associ and published by Funny Fox. Bon appétit. Welcome to Game Night Date Night. Tonight, we are going to play Dinner in Paris. Lincoln, why don't you give us a little overview? Sure. Dinner in Paris is a two to four player game where we are playing restaurateurs that are vying for restaurants. We'll have more than one in this newly uh, inaugurated square in Paris that's popular not only with the locals, but the tourists. <laughs> and what we do is we are buying these restaurants here to place them along this square. So they're weirdly, even Always. though here's the buildings yeah. over here, but it, we're playing on the two player board. So they're gonna be along these edges of this terrace here, right? No, it's not a terrace, what is it? A square, square. on the edge of the square. Terraces are these, which is, I think of as umbrellas, so who knows? Okay. Anyway, so all, all the terms are gonna be confused for me this time. But <laughs> we are going to be placing those restaurants and then growing our terraces by paying for them and placing them attached to our restaurants. There are some uh, placement guidance that you need to do, which Nikki will go over in a moment. Yep. We're gonna be collecting resources in food and money to be able to buy these restaurants. You buy the restaurants with food, not with money. And uh, then we buy the terraces with money. We'll also be vying for majorities based on these majority cards here that will give us points at the end of the game. 10 points and four points, right? And that means we're trying to have terraces, the majority of terraces around certain locations on this square. The flower beds, the musicians, the light posts, or this fountain. We would also be able to gain goods and stuff by covering up the squishing the tur uh, or kicking the pigeons, right? Don't kick the pigeons. Yeah, he just got a little present in his mouth there, so they, they've got a bunch of presents for us all. Um, and that's it. So why don't you tell us how to play, Nikki P? Okay. Um, so I, I just want to talk about the main board first. So these are all the resources. The resources are, like Lincoln said, going to be used to open up a restaurant of a particular type. The types you need are listed on your player board and I will get into that later. But here's an example of some of them. Some of them give you money, some of them give you an option of either or, and this one has two choices and then these other ones are just the baguette or the meats. meats. Yep. Um, I pulled out a few of the other ones just to show you that there are some, there are three, choices on this card, you choose one of them. And then here's just another two you choose that one you of, yeah. choose one okay, of. Okay, cool. Other resource types um, are potatoes. There's another baguette. There is flour. There's a f seafood by itself, chops, cheese, mm, yeah. and tomatoes. Just right. so you know what's in the deck. Um, there are definitely more of the ones than, right. than a choice cards. So those are the ones I had pulled out there. I will shuffle them back in the resource deck in a moment. The other card type on the board are majority cards. There's actually only one that is chosen for the one game. And underneath it, we'll show you your scoring. So we've got it, like Lincoln said, on the two player side. So the person that has the most of one of these three will get 10 points, and the person that comes in second with one of these three, or all of yeah, them. Yeah, you resolve, you resolve each one. <laughs> you yeah. will resolve each one, will get four. So this particular one is most terraces around a flower bed. Okay. All right? The other one is most terraces in the Rue, west. Yeah, Rue, Rue, Rue west. Quet, west. Yeah, West. So each section of the board yeah, this has. Is, this is east-west, this is south-north. Yeah. And then the last one is most restaurants. Okay. Some of these other cards could be, again, this one has a flower bed, but it also has around lamp posts. Oh, hey, there you go. Yeah. And then this is another side of... It's west the, again. We're west again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there's one for North. most money. Oh, no, south. South, and this one would be most terraces around the water feature. Um, and then there's a band, oh, yeah, band one on band, it, yeah. and then there's one with most pigeons covered, covered. up. Ooh, so you'd have to look that up. Boy, right. that'd be hard. It'd be kind of weird to track that because you have to lift up. 
I guess you kind of know where they're at, though. They're definitely... Um, you kind of do. Yeah. Um, so with that in mind, pigeons are the only thing you can cover up with a terrace. Any of these other features, you can only ever just build around them. You cannot cover up light posts, flowers, beds, or the water feature. The other card type is the objectives? objective cards. Right. The objective cards at the beginning of the game, we will each be handed two, and we will choose one of the two to be our hidden objective for the game. So I already gave Lincoln and myself two cards to choose from. These cards can be things like five terraces around a fountain. Again, another having um, nine terraces in a Rue Nord. And let's skip those and go to this kind of terrace shape. And I will explain shapes if, uh, in a minute. Then there are more that have to do with the features of the board, just like the water fountain. And then there is a terrace around each type of decor. So in order to gain five points, you would have to have one terrace type of each decor, of on, each the board. decor nice. on the board. And there are some more shapes. Right and things like that. So it's just a mix. And some of them are three points and some of them are five points and four points. I think five points is as high as they go. Okay. So Lincoln. We do too, right? Right now. Shovel these and put out two? Nope. Choose our two, choose from our first yep. one, ones first. Then we put two more out. What we do with this is, this is Did a very interesting. Did you mention that they're worth negative points if we don't do them? No, I didn't. Ah. Thank you, Lincoln. They are worth negative points if you don't do them. So says whatever. at the very bottom, in incomplete, all of your scenes. Incomplete. You didn't read that, though. So what happens is we're each going to choose one that we're, we think we can do by the end of the game. I'm going to take this one and keep it. The one we get rid of becomes an open objective that anyone could meet if they wanted to during the game. When you meet one of the open objectives, you take it. Okay. So that's how the objectives get seeded. Hmm. This is a tough one. I actually have two pretty <laughs> decent ones for once here. Goodness, they're both great. Okay, well, that's what we're going to do. <laughs> All right. So now this is seeded. We don't need two more though, right? Nope. When you complete an objective, you turn it face up in front of you and you draw a new objective from the top of the objective deck, and you can choose to keep it as a personal objective or discard it and make it a open objective uh, yeah, okay. for everybody. Cool. Um, all right, the other card type on the board is the pigeons. The pigeons sort of follow the same sort of objectives like um, the ob uh, objective cards and the majority cards. When well, you place a terrace on top of a pigeon, you will draw a pigeon card. Some pigeon cards are immediate action, that's the lightning bolt, and some of them are play when you want to play. And that is the hourglass on the card. Do you find in some good ones there? You can draw an objective or you can do two uh, uh, objectives in your turn. That was, okay. I remember that, that's cool. Yeah, so they're cool little rule breakery things and extra points and more money as you could see on that two, two card. Cool. Okay. So let's say you've got your correct ingredients for opening a restaurant. The rules of placement of a restaurant is you will pay your right. resources. ingredients, your resources. Then you will place one of your one of the types that you paid for. Right. And you We'll place it on the edge of the board. It can go anywhere you want, as long right. as it's on the edge of the board, as long as it's not covering up the um, It can be directly adjacent to edge. another building, right? It can be, I could on my turn place this one, and then later on I go like this, I do not have to place near right. myself. I can go all the way over here if I want, and right. that might ruin something for you. So right. there's a little bit of take that. When I place a restaurant, 
I will take the type of restaurant. This is a bar of in. Bar of on. And I will take this little tile and I will place it on the top. This says that this is my restaurant. Right. Okay. So that's sort of the rules of the placement. I can also place right next door. I can place the second right. type. These are clearly limited to the number of buildings, um, the number have, of buildings we have. The Freet is the cheapest one and also Freetery. the Freetery is, yep. is the most lowest cost and the and we have the most of them. And then the last one here, uh, gastronomy. gastronomy, there is only one of them and it's crazy expensive to do. Okay, so let's say I've got my restaurant and Lincoln's got his restaurant over here and put a pizza on there a to mark pizza. it as yours. Pizza, yeah. From our player board, which I will explain, you will have all of the terraces. If I want to place terraces, I have to be able to afford them. And there's a money track here on the side. You start out with just one money at the beginning of the game. The yellow cube is the marker of, of how much income you have at the beginning of every turn. And the white cube is just to help you keep track of what you spend. So I want to put some terraces in front of Barvin and I have enough money for them. I have to choose from the line where the bar VIN is, which well, would be this from the line, left, right? and I will draw from here, yeah. and you work your way towards the end. Yeah, so the cost there would be three. So this is showing me that it is three, so I would move my marker down to place one. Terrace placements rules are, when you place your first terrace, it has to be on a restaurant, so it can't Adjacent, be yep. anywhere on the board. It has to be, and it has to be in front of that restaurant. Okay? Yeah. Um, I can place another one, if I have the money for it, right here, if I want to. Yep, get a pigeon card. And then I just covered up a pigeon. A pigeon, pigeon, pigeon uh, telegram. Pigeon telegram. So I would take a pigeon card and I'd look at it and see what I have to do. On uh, later turns, I'll just grab some of these and put them out. You can start placing like this if you want. They must be orthogonally adjacent. Um, I put that there for a good reason though. You want to show totally that. Totally did. Yeah. One thing I wanted to also say was it ha uh, the rule of in front of the restaurant is you cannot place yeah, between, yeah, a between. terrace on the yeah. restaurant edge yeah. board. So that would be a legal placement. Um, if I wanted to be mean, which this does have a little bit of take that, I could start placing in front of, yeah. in front of somebody else's restaurant. The rule with placing is that one square must be between a restaurant, a your, terrace. An other terrace, yeah, the competing restaurant's terrace. But also your own. So if you put a blue one. Oh, for a second one. Yeah. From a second restaurant. Put a blue one. I'm gonna pay two that I don't have. You're right. That is the only legal place where he could place that at this point because it's his first restaurant. It has to be in front of his restaurant and he cannot place right next to me. Now, right. if this was my restaurant, pizzeria, pizzeria, do, do, do. Having the terraces like this is illegal. I myself, if it's two different restaurants, cannot place in front. Have, have, have to have a space between my terraces. So, but you could, could since that that's there, then legal. you could do that, right? If that yes. piece was still on the pigeon, right? That's legal. Okay. But this right. is not. Okay. Okay. So that's the um, placement of terraces, and as I said before, you cannot place them on top of these features. The water fountain, you can the only flowers. Kick the pigeons. You can only stomp but you on can't pigeons. You can't kick the pigeons. Those guys are fast. <laughs> okay. 
All right, let's move to what happens on a player board. The player board shows you a bunch of stuff. It shows you the money um, that you have, your income at the beginning of each turn. It also shows you um, what resources you have to have to build a particular restaurant type. So in the free, free tree, free tree yeah. you are going to have to have two potato resources. So two potato cards. Two bags of potatoes. Two bags of potatoes to build a free Friedery. What do you get from that? At the end of the game, you are going to get two points. You're going to get zero bump in income. Okay. All right. Um, if we were building something, uh, one of these from this row here, pizzeria, whatever, um, you will uh, need, you will get three points at the end of the game and your income marker will go up one. So now on the next turn, I will have a max of two uh, gold. gold I can spend. Or francs. Francs. And, or francs. And that's what all of these show. So I, uh, in the crippery, I will have to have two flowers and a cheese. And for that, I will get three victory points and a bump up in Income. Income. No, cr no chocolat. What's going on here with Chocolate that crepe? Show? I don't no, know. No, it's not hot. Not, not hot chocolate, but just the chocolate on the crepes. <laughs> it's a very simple crepe Crapery, restaurant. It's just cheese and. And so that's what you need in resources to uh, place a restaurant. The next thing that it shows you on your player board, which we kind of went over when I was explaining the placement of terraces, is how much it will cost you to place a terrace. You can see here in the what this white line here ends up, ends over here. So for all of these terraces from here to here, it'll cost me one for each one I want to place. One frank, okay. Once I get up to the end of the line here, the next terraces I place in front of a fruitery will cost me two coins. Right in order to place, and that's a little bit of a smaller, that's uh, five. And then the last three will cost me three points each, or three coins each to place. Okay. Okay. In addition to that though, what happens is there are victory points on, underneath all of the terraces. So if I only manage to build, let's say three terraces, from this line, at the end of the game, I will get three points right. for this. If I build another one, I will get a you permanent bump, up, bump, bump up on your income. in income. Nice. And it keeps going up, there's another bump. This one only goes as high as 14 points at the end of the game if you build all the terraces. Right, all on, on friederies. All on just friederies. Uh, the highest one is 34 points if you build all of these terraces in front of a the brasserie or the gastronomique. Or the gastronomique. A gastronomique, just for building one, you will get 12 points. Hmm. And then if you start putting terraces in front of it, there's additional points and additional bumps up in your permanent hmm. income. Okay. Uh, one thing to point out when I keep saying permanent income is that anything with the yellow cube is a permanent income. If you draw a resource card of one, it is not permanent. It does not right. bump up your permanent income. One you use. use it and yep. it's a one-time use and you will be discarding anything that, any of the resources that you use right. and putting them on this side of the board. So now there are three end game possibilities one of the three will end the game and you play out the round. So the first one is in a two player game, if 11 of these buildings are built, we would play out our turn and that would be that. Hmm. Okay. This scales for number of players. Okay. The other one is um, if a player places all of their terraces from two of these lines. Right. So if I clear this one out and this one out, um, that will trigger the end of the game. I keep making a mess. Keep dragging your hand across. I know it. I do. Uh, that is the second 
end game, end game condition. condition. Yeah. The last end game condition is if there is no legal placement on the board, restaurant okay. or terrace. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. We will then add up all our points from our player board. Yep. We will any cards? add up any cards that we have that give right. us points at the end of the game. There is a sheet that we will fill out to make sure we um, cover, to make them sure all. We yeah. cover, <laughs> cover everything. I forgot the most important thing. Guess what I forgot, Lincoln? What we're going to do. <laughs> what you're going to do on your turn. Uh, you, there are two phases. The first phase has one action in it and one action only. You draw a card. You have to draw a, a resource card. Okay. All right. You have a hand limit of seven. Just keep that in mind when you are drawing resource cards. When you draw a resource card, it is immediately replenished in the line. Okay. That is phase one. That's the only thing you do that is what you have to do. There's no choice. Okay. The second phase, you have four different action types and you choose two of them. So in a complete turn, you have three actions that you do. The first one being having to draw a resource card. That means that in phase two, if you wanted to, you could draw another resource card. And again, you could draw a third resource card okay. and then all your actions would be done. But the other actions you could choose to do on your turn is Buy a restaurant. Buy a restaurant. Yeah. You would buy a restaurant and you would place it. To open a restaurant, you will spend the, the resources, in this case it's two potatoes, and you will gain two points at the end of the game, and you will get zero bump up in your permanent Yeah, income. that's just the freightery. The other ones actually yes. have more, right? So it's yes. you gain a bump of one for the fruit de mer and the pizzeria and the creperie. Mm -hmm. two for the grill and the bar of on, and three for the brasserie, and four for the gastronomique. Right. Okay, well, that's cool. You can build terraces. That's the third thing? That is the third thing. The other thing you can choose to do is complete one of your personal or um, open face objectives. Okay, and you can only do one of those. You could unless you had, like, one of these... Pigeon cards that allowed you to... Uh, you can do a second one on your turn. With that card, yeah, that we yeah, saw. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Um, the one exception to the two of these actions at a time is the terrace card. Ter terrace building card. terraces. Right. You can only choose that action once. You can't choose it twice. However, when you build terraces, you can build as many as you can afford. Right. And so this is basically going to just stay in the position, and then we're just going to track it. Yes. How much we spend with this. With the clear cube. Okay. Cool. All right. I think we're ready to start. Well, I am going to shuffle. to shuffle in my example cards here. Yep. Goodness gracious. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay. The rules are actually the last person to eat out at a restaurant. Oh, I remember that on the when we did this on the stream. Yes. Uh, yeah, that was kind of weird. So, eeny, meeny, my <laughs> Yeah, you really, it's rock, paper, scissors. Go All ahead right. and start, Nikki P. I'm going to get these out of the way because we are not going to use those. I don't even know what I have as my four ingredients, and I already forgot what my secret objective is. Yeah, mine is not that hard, I don't think, but I this one I would like to try to go for, but it's tough. I think... Well, the first thing I have to do, I will take the coin. Then that nice. refills right away. Hey, another coin. Okay. And then the next um, thing I will do is uh, phase two, but I will choose another card. Okay. And then I have a third action. And why not? I will build a freightery. So that's two potatoes. 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 This is not a Lord of the Rings game. Here you go. Thank you. I will put it right here. And, um, all right, I have two victory points for the end of the game. Okay. And that was my three actions. Okie dokie. Huh. I say. 
I have to take a card. So the first thing I will take, what would I, what would I, what can I do if I have, that's not good. I don't have any repeats. Hey, don't throw your freedery. Sorry. Out. I forgot to mark my freedery. Freedery. My freedery. I will take some chops. Actually meat, just meat. Hmm. Poof. We got a lot of that. Well, the crepe place wants a lot of flour and, yeah, and one cheese. I will take the money. Okay. Yeah, why don't you grab that for me so sure. knock your, your fritery down. There and then I'm go. going to oh build. Oh my gosh, okay. It's a lot. Hey, that, doesn't that wipe? It does wipe, which, which is you didn't another mention, yeah. rule I didn't yeah, say. Yeah, so those all go. Three of the same type, you wipe all of it. Boo. I should have grabbed that flour. Oh, there's a variety again, but no flour. Max seven cards. I guess that means I should build. Um, I'm close. I will build a grill, I guess. Okay. I think I have it. I have the, one of the three different types. Choose one. That'll be my potatoes. Okay. That'll be my tomatoes. That'll be my cheese. And that will be my meat. Meat. So that's that cost. Cool. And then uh, I will choose a bar. Right, that was the one I chose. No, I did the grill. Did grill, the grill. grill, sorry. Yeah, no, I, you, you did, I said the bar. So I'll put the grill out. I'm gonna put it right uh, here. All right. Okay. Mark it. Oh yeah, with my own little. Very important. Okay. Tray, tray, important. And now your permanent income has bumped up by goes two. up two. Nice. Okay. Yeah. Good. Okay. Was that three actions? That is three because I drew two cards and built my building. Okay. Or opened my restaurant. I didn't build it. No building. I mean, I did because it wasn't there it. before. But yes. What other restaurant am I trying to go for here? No flour. Okay. Yeah, I know, that's a bummer. No. I really should have taken the flour. Because I, I was going to go for a crepery. Cheese, Although that one is card there cheese good. out here? Let's take some cheese. 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 More money, too. Tomato. Tomatoes. What do I got? What do I got? Potatoes. Uh, I will take... Will I take? Or will I build a terrace? I will take a coin. So there's two actions. Refill that. Refill. No flower. Jiminy Christmas. I guess I'll be drawing another card. Card. Let's get a tomato. Another freedery wouldn't be too bad if you have potatoes. Tomato. Since there's so many tomato. terraces. Three potatoes. Three potatoes. Hey, well, I'm going to get to choose from something else. Well, maybe it'll be better. Right. Maybe. <laughs> right. Well, I was talking about doing a freedery. There's some fish. Yep. Cheese. Cheese. Money. Hey, money's not bad either. And a tour. Twofer. Okay. Twofer. Choose one. And you're done? You uh, three yeah, cards? I drew three cards. Okie okay, doke. Five, six, Oof. I have exactly, yeah, exactly seven, seven. So Okay, well, I'll take this. You choose one. I forgot what my secret, I keep forgetting my secret, secret objective. Okay, flip another one for me over there. Oh. I'll take that one too. Yeah, you will. <laughs> and flip another one for me there. Cool. I am going to build a terrace, I guess. Oh, wait. Yeah, this is fine. Um, so I'll build one. Okay. Which is going to cost me three because it's all I got. So I, I don't mark it without. I just do one, two, three. And I take one from the this track, which shows that it costs three. The grill. And I'm going to put it right there on a pigeon. Yay. Hey, pigeon, you're going to give me something. Squash. Thank you, kind bird. Don't be mean to the pigeons. Wow. Is it a lightning bolt or an hourglass? Uh, it's a lightning bolt. So it has to it draw two resource cards. I like that. So nice for you. You can always draw blind, by the uh, way. <laughs> yeah. So I put that. I'll discard that here. And I will take a meat. I'm assuming that when it's a pigeon card, the same. Same, rule probably. Applies. Yeah. I'm gonna take the money though. Okay. Cool. Now potatoes again. Okay. 
It is your turn. Okay. Well, I have to take a card, and I will have to build, or I will have to discard. Fruits de mer. What can I build? Still no flower. What are these restaurants with no flower? Well, I didn't get one right. I drew two multiple choice cards, and neither of them had flower on them. Mm, I blew it. Oh, well. <laughs> I guess it's any shape. Do you shape. want to take another No, no, no. This is a while ago. This is a while ago. I uh, forgot. I was thinking it was a different shape. I have, I, I'm spoiling it. I have a shape card. A shape. Shape. The shape of things to come. Okay, here we go. Ooh, bread. Oh, man. Can't you draw another or are you done? I could. Okay, so let's do a restaurant. And it also is going to be a grill. I don't mean to be a copycat. Whatever. I haven't built a freighter <laughs> yet. So uh, let's do it in order. So this is going to be my potato and my tomato. Cheese and meat. Cheese and meat. So that takes care of my hand limit problem too. Yeah, I'm getting close here. And this well. is a grill. Guess what I'm going to do hmm. next door. I say hmm to that. I'm totally competing with you. I know. The same kind what is of... It? What is this? Some kind of... No, what? I don't thing? want it there, actually. Oh, oh you should have done it, but... No, fine. because here's the reason. I put this here and realized I got myself blocked by the stupid flowers. Yeah, that's not a bad thing for that goal, For though. this yeah. goal, but I don't want to be blocked again. So... Why don't you shift it over in front of one of the pigeons, like I did? Pigeon. So that yeah. you can build directly off okay. of it and get a... There's that. And a grill actually will get me up... Two. Two. One, two. I, I'm going to build one terrace in front of my free place. Boop. Okay. And that goes there. And then... No, I'm, it doesn't adjust, right? I'm sorry. And then... That only cost one. You can do two more. I, I'm going to build a grill, a uh, terrace in front of my grill. Oh no, that's three. Yeah. That wow. didn't work. That's why I only built one. It was three, three, uh, three francs. Sure. Or whatever. Why not? <laughs> we will build two more in front of my free Freetery. Do. So, loop. That's all my money. I am gonna hey, step pigeon on a time. pigeon. No, you're just you're not stepping on him. He's got a gift for you. And it's known as bird turds. Hey, oh, lightning bolt. Place an additional terrace on the same restaurant for free. Well, there you go, that bumps up your income. That's great. Oh yeah, so that's free. Let's go this way. And then I go up to four. Um, Build, terrace, take card. Done. Okay. Uh, one thing I wanted to add was if you're doing one of the shape ones, it doesn't have to be that orientation. Yeah, it can be any direction. Yeah, as yeah. long as you can find it in oh, yeah, the yeah. group. Yeah. Well, that was what I was saying. I, I <laughs> kind of blew it there, but I realized, oh, I just changed the orientation. So if this is a big, huge square of Lincoln yeah. Terraces, yeah, you, it if would you fill can a lot make shapes, that yeah. shape within in there, it, yep. then, then that counts. Okay. <laughs> I don't need any of these, but I can also draw from the top, can't can I? Yep. Sweet, let me do that. Oh my gosh, that was so amazing. Um, uh, I think that you are not. Being it's not truthful. bad. It's not bad. <laughs> uh, we really need flour. Yeah, we do. Where's the flour? So I've drawn one. I'll do one. So I will build. Well, maybe not. Will I open a restaurant? No. I'm going to do terraces. So I will build. Uh, I will build this. Ooh. Popping it out the end. Okay, first I do that one. That costs me three, but it also bumps up my income, which is good. Okay. So let's just do that. And I will build another one for these three coins that I have. Mm. But it gets my card at my hand limit down. Yeah. So I'll do no another kidding. one. Eh, come out of there. Okay. Shit. Okay. There you go, Nick P. Your turn. Was that three actions? Oh, no, that wasn't. No. I only drew one card. Drew one card and you built some terraces. So yep. you have another action. Uh, I guess I'll have the baguette. Please. A baguette. Lincoln Thank likes you. baguettes in I do, real I life. I do like baguettes, but okay. A lot. Ooh, a coin. Another coin. Boo. That would have been what I would like. Uh, let's see. I got four cards and 
let's take a. I also, I actually had. What happened? I, yeah. I actually, I have, I have one coin back. You do. Yeah, I overspent. Because so you built that. and you knocked your. Um, I bumped that up immediately, and I forgot to, it. I forgot to do this, so it would have been two coins. So yes. Okay. But that puts me back up at six. But that's okay. At least I have a little bit of coin. <laughs> a little coin in my pocket. A little change. Potatoes. Mm. Actually, oh, there's more potatoes. Good. More potatoes. Okay. Can I build anything with what I have right now? We really need, um, very badly need to get... Flour. Yes. I will take uh, fish seafood. So that's two actions. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> I think I want to build terraces though. If I take that, You're that's done. it. Yeah. I want to build terraces. So. Yay. The grill. <laughs> Le grill is going to be three. First, let me use up my coins to help with my hand limit. So there's two and then three uh, grill. There's one terrace. Pigeon? Step on a pigeon. It's not stepping I on know. a pigeon. They're delivering you. I know. See, it's sweet. Yeah. And this is whenever I want. He dropped it when you tried to kick him though. He's like, hey, 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 just leave me alone. Here you go. I'll chew on a dog. Okay. And uh, I still uh, can build another one in front of the grill for three more. Yep. One, two, three, I'm out. Doot. That is going to go right here. That bumps up my yellow limit income. Nice. By one. So really I'm here. If I wanted to build another freight, I c uh, terrace I could. I might as well. Okay, so I will spend it and build one more terrace in front of my palm frite place. You know what, Nikki? I just looked at the rules and we are not allowed to take that income. So you have to take that oh. one terrace back. All right. Which is fine. And I give that coin back because we it's not available to your next turn. I was just, it occurred to me that maybe that wasn't the case. It is now my turn. I will take, obviously, the three for three for of one. Of course. Really, not three for one. Three choice of three. Um, wow, more money. Have some coins. What do I have? Oh man, I, I I can probably go crazy though here, so I'm going to do it. Give me the potatoes, I believe. Let me double check that that's correct. Yes, give me a potato. Okay, two actions. Yeah, now I'm going to build the gastronomy. Uh, I'm but going look crazy. At what I know. That is. I know. Finally, flour. Well, Tempting. now, now I'm, yeah, but I got the whole thing here. Okay. So I have the potatoes I just had you hand me. I have the tomatoes on this card. I have the cheese on this card. Oh, are you doing a crepe? No, no. I'm going for the. I'm going for the gastronomy. I've got the <sighs> the meat, the baguette. You're kidding me. The flour. And the fish. Lincoln. I know, I'm going crazy. Woo! And okay. that is the only one. Yeah, gastronomic. Dang. So I will, I want to be on both of these so I can maybe compete on the flower bed. Or at least get four points out of it. Okay, you so need those to are be all gone. on the board. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. Do you want to be in front of this pigeon or this pigeon? I'm, I'm in the right spot for, okay. cho for choice. Bump up your income. Oh, yeah, four. Four, yeah. Okay. Next, so what are you at? Income? I'm now at eight. Jeez. Okay. So I guess that when you do this, this income is available now. It's different than the terrace. The terrace specifically said that, but it doesn't, yeah. it's, it's in the rule books for these, it's from now on. So right. Opening I a do restaurant. Have eight. Yeah. It's right now. Okay. Terrace, next turn. <laughs> okay, your turn, Nick. Well, I have to draw something so definitely the flower yeah that's hard to get hey we're gonna be hey more what? flour what? we're gonna be sh reshuffling though well not so soon all right can i build anything the threes really kind of wipe them out fast though if you get not build kind. open can i open a restaurant yeah right okay i'm gonna do a crepe place crepe crepe 
So that is two flour, so I will use that for flour, mm -hmm. flour, and cheese. Anchovies, what? No, cheese. No anchovies. Well, they might be in with the fish place. And where do I want to put this? I need to bother you. What? Yeah. What? Right next door. Okay. Okay, I need to mark it. You didn't mark yours. No, I did not. Crepe, a crepe place. My restaurateur is he's like, we're going big. None of this small stuff. And I say I know. no. <laughs> I say no. I have no cards, so. Crepe. Right there, and that cost me two. Okay. And um, then I can do another two for, oh wait. Could do three. I, I need to draw my, my pigeon. pigeon. Oh, it's a lightning. Draw two resource cards. Nice. Well, that means you're probably able to build something big. That's what helped me do it. One, two. And I'm gonna draw, uh, build, Another terrace in my crepe place. So that is... Is it three? I thought it was two. It's two. Okay. So you're down to one. I'm down to one. So crepe place. Then I have one left, so I will just build another one. In front of your in freedery. In front of my freedery, which is only costs one. So coming around the corner. Kay. Okay. And yes, I drew two resources. And I'm still okay on my hand limit. Okie dokie. I will take... I guess it depends on what I build. So, I will take one off the top. Be something other than there. Okay, that's a good thing. And... I'll take a coin. One coin. And then I will spend... A baguette. A baguette is a good one. I am now going to spend... Can't see here. Yeah, sometimes yeah. I heard people play... Yeah, it's even not great to see it there, but I'm going to do that just temporarily. Okay. So I'm going to build one off my brasserie since Nikki P is crowding me over here. I am crowding you. That cost me four. So let's go down four. One, two, three, four. And I will build uh, one, another one for four. Oh, and that first one, actually, maybe not. That gives me that gives me my income bump right there. Um, and I'll build one for three. Do one, two, three. Still, it's not quite. Oh wait, no, I still I can't do it. Um, yeah, I'll do one for three here in front of the uh, the. Uh, Grill? Yep, my grill. I keep trying to say it's the bar of on, but I did not build one. And that is, so that's three. One, two, three. And that is it. You need to build a freightery. It's a good way to get rid of it's just one coin. It truly is. Coin. You don't want to waste it. It's <laughs> truly, truly true. Okay, your turn. All right. I will take a fish. Seafood. Seafood. Tomatoes. Ooh, good. I will take a baguette. Un baguette. Una. Ooh, meat. Meat. I will fruits de mar. Fruit de mar. Fruit de mar. So that takes two seafood and a baguette. Oops. Okay. Fruit of the sea. Is that really what it means? Yeah. Right in front of a pigeon. It's pretty Right smart. in front of a pigeon. Pigeon. A pigeon. And that is my three actions. Okay. Do I, have I want. I'll have a tomato. 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 Can I build anything? Hey, another no. tomato. Yeah. Pizza time, but I'm not quite there. Um, I'll take the meat. And then I'm going to uh, build some terraces. So those are going to each cost me four, no matter which ones I choose. Okay. So build one here. And that's four. 
one, two, three, four, and then build another one. Ooh. Right here. Okay. And I need to bump up my income for that one. Okay. And you jumped up to those terraces being more expensive. That's why I spent four on okay. each of those, yeah. So that's that other one. One, two, three, four. I'll even take a coin. Hey, reshuffle the deck. Hey, and I will one. be taking that. Yeah. That's two actions. And then we reshuffle. Do you want to do that or me? No, go ahead. You're faster with that. <laughs> I know it's your turn, but it's the little ones you can get those corners better than I can. With your little hands. Ah. It's true, though. I don't know why. I grabbed them wrong. Now you're saying my now, skills, yeah, yeah, and now I'm nervous on, about it. On display. It. Yeah. Okay. Now here's the scary part. Well, it, no, it wouldn't ever be yeah, three. Yeah, it won't be three on that one. <laughs> hey, a coin. Another here. coin. Okay, I have one more action. Sure do. You know what, Nikki? I don't think you actually gave yourself the... You built like two, a couple. Yeah. So you, you, I think you bump up your uh, your income too for oh, this turn. It would, yeah, it would... It's better for you right now, two, yeah. So seven? Yep. Okay. So for the fish place, it is two. So one, two. And that bumps my income up by one, except not right now because it's a terrace here. Another pigeon. Front of the pigeon. There you go. Pigeon, lightning, place an additional terrace on the same restaurant. Wow. So I will do that right now here. That Creepery. will be my additional. Did you just do it? Oh, yeah, I did on the fruit tomorrow. Yeah, I did it on that one. Yep. How do I want to go? Let's go in front like that. Then, um, then I start paying again. And I will, I'm just going to two, uh, one, two, one, two. Okay. So two terraces. Cool. And I have one left still, so I will do another one. The Friedery, okay. Okie doke. My turn. Let's see. What do I need? Oh boy. I need something that is not visible. Give me a coin. And I'll take those potatoes. That gives me... Meat came up in yeah. case that's something. Nope. Okie doke. I'm going to do terraces now. Okay. So I can do one for four here on my... I'll do that right in front of that pigeon, right? Yes. I can barely see it. So I get a pigeon card. Okay. So that's four. One, two, three, four. I'll do another one for four. Really can't see it. I know. Uh, let's do that. That's correct, or was I like this? I was you were right, right next, next door yeah, okay. to you. Yep. And I will build, oh, that was four, right? Second one. And that is, my last one is another four if I want. And I have two coins, so I'll do that. So that's one, two, three, four. Okay. And I will build it here. Okay. Okay. I've hopped into three territory here with this one. The cost, yeah. Yeah. But I will do it. So. That goes down to five. Um, 
I have a coin, so I will build a third terrace with the coin. There, from here. Now it's gonna go there, and then that bumped my income up by one. Okay. And I can't do anything Draw a card. Else, so I will draw a card. I will draw a tomato. Ooh. Nice. Yeah, yeah. There's a reason to not save that for last. That is not what I need, but I probably will just take it. It's a choice. Yeah, it's a it's good thing. Not necessarily a choice I need right now. I completed an objective a few turns ago. Uh, not this one. The uh, This one is I... I finish this shape. It's oh, this sweet. way, right? Okay. So I see it. Go. That one's. You will get four points. Okay, let's see what I got here. Huh. I mean, if it's not a good one, you right. can put it out in the right open objectives and remember, you know, you're going to get minus points if you don't finish it. So. I know. Game's not over yet, though. So I will keep this one. Maybe. Seems okay. All right. Uh, it goes here. So my last thing I guess I can do is do uh, spent build terraces. Okay. I'll do one for this, for the uh, over here. The fancy pants restaurant. Yep. And I can place it right here. Yep. As it caused an earthquake. That's okay. I knocked down my signage. That knocked you into another. That cost me Price. six, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. And I will place one of these for f here for four. One, two, three, four. Okay, your turn. Okay. Do I have that shape yet? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I knew, I knew what I was doing too, so no biggies. All right, let's see. I have to take a card. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh. Okay. Meat. It's what's for dinner. Mwah. All right. Then I will build some terraces again. So uh, I want to build in front of this place. It's three. So six. And I go right here. I messed up that that for myself. Yep. That was not Well you, you got another one though. And you're going around the you're going around the uh, flower bed, so and then Which is gonna give you ten points because I'm not gonna catch up. Three to that. is that. Well that's not around I mean, well it most terraces around. Mm -hmm. Um I just paid for another one of these, and I'm going to put it here. And one, two, three again. Am I going to do that to myself? No. I think you spent too much there because you've now bumped into the oh, four four point territory. I did. So let's put that back because I cannot afford it. But you can do the freedery. I can do. Or uh, the grill for three. I'll do the grill. Yep. And right. I completed a, p a public goal of yep. nine in this district. So there's that. Okay, I got to draw a card. I want that flower, I believe. Wait, okay. do I want that flower? I do not. Uh, I will draw a potato. That sounds good. Sounds delicious. And then I'm going to build... Tomatoes have come up. And I'm going to build a freedery. You're not going to like what I do here. That's okay. Two potatoes. It's going to go over here. Sure. You won't... I have a card that lets me do ah, that. Ah, ha, ha. Um, the sneaky card. You can place terraces adjacent to other terrace uh, players' terrace and cover up to two terraces. Sweet. So I'm going to... I'm going to build a lot of these. Okay. This one, my first one, which cost me one, I build right here in the corner. 
And then I will build another one that covers up that one. Okay. You have to kind of work to get that one. I think you were going there. And then I will build another one. I was. Not a big deal. And I will build another one, which I, I bumped up my income. I haven't bumped it up yet, but I do bump it up now. Yep, that's okay. Oh, because of the cards. Yep, my adjacency. Your adjacent I can, I can, cards I can still. place. I can place terraces adjacent to other players' terraces and cover up to two terraces. Mm -hmm. And then, um, and I will build another one for one. Here. That's one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Not marking that as I should. And I will build another one for one. <laughs> I mean, I can really wow. do it. I can do it. Look at you go. And I can build another one for one. And I can build another one for one. And I can build another one for two. Do I want to do that? Boy, this guy, this Friedery guy is a real pain He's in the rear mean. end. But I'm going to do that. That bumps my He's income up another mean. one. Look at that. So I've, I've gone up two income here. My grill is 12. done. And uh, um, that is done, isn't it? Um, Maybe. Yeah, I'm, I've, got an, I've got a goal that uh, is, is a challenge. And that's why I ended up doing exactly Because there was no way I was going to build in that. Qu I couldn't build here. Well, I did have the card. I realized once I had the card, I actually probably should have done it right there and gone through there. Um, but I'll tell you in a minute it, when I when I may finish that goal. All right. And then um, I think okay. And then I uh, I think I'm done. I will take this one. Yep. Hmm. But I'm gonna build a pizzeria. So that is two tomatoes and a flower. So there's one, two and a flower, and there's a pizzeria. Okay, pizza, 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 pizza. This is a Little Caesars in Paris? <laughs> that's just, uh, that's All right. sacrilege, pizza. even though we're not in Italy. Knocks me up one. One income, yeah. One income, yay. And um, I can build terraces again. You know what? I'm not. I'm going to take this. Yep. Darn it. Okay. I was hoping that was going to stay. Hey, Come there's on, another one there for you me. Go. Okay, good. You're okay. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I will draw the money. Okay. And what do we got here? Is there something? Another money. More money. I'll take the the fish, the seafood. Go ahead and flip it. And maybe I'll take another one. No. Nope. Potatoes. Okay. And then I'm going to build terraces. So, first thing I will do is build one here, which gives me um, a uh, a bump in my income, which I can't count. But that was uh, started there, so I built that. That cost five. One, two, three, four, five. Um, I'll build this one as well, mm -hmm. which get is another five. One, two, three, four, five. Get a pigeon. Get a pigeon card. Draw two resource cards. Well, that's pretty great. So let me see what I can do here. Of course, I Are am. Are you close I, to your hand limit? I am, so I'm going to have to spend this money probably. Uh, so what do I need here? I know I need, I really need flour. Um, but I will take the tomatoes okay. and then flip it for me. Money again. Oh my gosh. And uh, How many resources was that? Two or three you could take? I could take two. I'll take another money and then that'll let me build two terraces, I think, on the, uh, the fritery. Oh, three potatoes. All right, sw swipe cool. it. Hopefully we get some flour in there. I don't mind, as long as there's a chance for me to get flour. So now I have to get rid of cards, and I will be building my ter terraces. 
um, well, continuing to build my terraces because that was the card. This will cost me an additional two. And this will cost me an additional two. This is the coins yep, you're using, yep. right? Now I'm back under. Your hand limit? Yep. And that is the end of my turn. Okay. I'm going to take the baguette. Oh my gosh, flour. And cheese, the things I needed. I didn't even notice. Well, you're safe because I am going to build some terraces. This is going to be four. So, six, because that's cost four. And I'm going to place it. Um, yep, that's great. Here. And I can still build more, so I will. Oh, and that bumped me up, but I'll do it at the end of my turn. And I'll do it now, so you track it. So I track you just Because okay. you've already started spending, so it's not going to—it's not uh, going to affect it till next turn. Okay. Then um, another four gets me to two. And I'm going to go right here. And now I have one, two. Can I do anything for three still? Yes. One in front of the grill for three. So that gets me to my card. Uh, keeps my card hand correct, and it goes in front of the grill, which I can't build in front of. <laughs> okay. So take that back. Put that there. I had two, and I had a, I had a one coin card. Okay. So uh, maybe oh. I just build in front of my free place. So one, two. Uh, Rows two. And one of those coins. I You're can't now in the do two. it. Yep. I'm in the two zone. Yeah, you keep bumping up one, one into the next level. Okay. I have too many cards. I know. <laughs> you throw it away. Okay, I'll get rid of a card. And uh, for my last action, I am going to. Uh, do my objective card. Sweet. So it Another makes... pattern one. Yeah, so it's that one, right? Mm, yeah. It's this way. Okay. That one there. Wow, four points. Good. And there's that. And then I draw one and decide if I want to keep it or not. Sure don't. Okay. It's an easy one, but one I don't know. One terrace around each streetlight. Each streetlight. Yeah. This, at this point in the game, I don't know. Well, you can't build on streetlights. What's left? I can't even see them. Well, there's a street light here and here. Are there more street lights? Nope, that's it. We shouldn't have built on them if we didn't, so there's only two. I could take that one. I get that one, right? One terrace around each street light, yeah. So it's my turn. I have to draw a card. Uh, well, darn it. I'm tempted to not to take, I'm tempted to take something else, but I don't want it to reset because of that. So I will take a flower. You can call me flower. If you want to, okay. Another flower. Wow. Okay, I'm glad Here's I didn't. Here's your wish I'm glad for I, flower. I, but I'm glad I didn't take what I wanted to take because then there would be no flower. Yeah. So um, I am at exactly. So I'm at no. I'm at seven. Okay. First thing is, I get this terrace. I have three terraces in each quarter. This put me over three. This has three. Oh wait, yeah. This has three in this one. Mm -hmm. I have three in this one and three in this one. Goodness. So I get that one. I get to draw a card, see if I want to do it. Wow. I hope it's good for me and you it don't want it. probably is. It's probably a completion right when you do it. Wow. Wowzy, I don't want to give you five points for that. I'm giving you three because I didn't even. Yeah, it's true. But um, hey, can you survive the negative if you don't make it and then you just keep it in your hand? And you take the negative at no, the end of the I'm, game. No, I'm going to have to put it out here for you. It's an immediate uh, one you get, and it sucks. Okay, and then... Um, yeah. And then... Uh, it, it's there, I see it. You just mm -hmm. flip it, and it's, mm -hmm. it's this shape right yeah, there. Yeah, I see okay. it. It's a fish. It sucks. Um, fishy, fishy. And I'm at seven. 
I will do my terraces. That's more important to me to be able to potentially claim that one. So I will spend five for this one. One, two, three, four, five. I will put that in front of the grill. Goodness, the grill is just busy with stuff here. Then I will place the last one, which is seven. Your grill is better than my grill. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Your grill chef. I don't know. Well, we're just doing okay right now. Um, I don't know about that. And that finishes that row. And that is my turn. All right. Your hand limit's okay? Yep, seven. For my first action, I will be taking... Flower. Flower. Well, at least that means it won't... Uh, that turns over. And then I'm going to take this public... Um, goal there. Goal. Objective. Mm -hmm. and You already um, have it. Yep. I have it already. So, boom. Uh, I'll put it right there. All right. I have seven cards right now. So... Uh, I will try to build something. Let's see. Or, no, I can't do it that way. Uh, is there, okay, the bar bin is still available, and that takes a cheese. Takes a cheese, uh, bar van takes... Cheese meat. Cheese meat, flour, and bread. Flour and bread. So that, that's good. That gets rid of a lot of cards from my hand. So here we go. Nice. I just don't know where to build, <laughs> where to put it right now. Put it in front of a pigeon. Yeah, but do I put it this way or this way? Do I put it this way? I don't want to block me. So I'll put it here. Maybe my barvin will do better than my grill. Right. Do you have a barvin? No, you don't. Okay. No. So there's that. Uh, drew, opened, completed. So that's my actions. Okay. Um, I have to draw one. I will draw the cheese. Uh, give me the cheese and potatoes, even though it doesn't make any difference. Okay. I will complete a goal. First one is I've got all the terraces from a, a category. Mm -hmm. So that one right there. And I will do an, oh, problem is I've got uh, one too many thingies here. So I'm just gonna stop on that and I'm going to build. So, or open a restaurant. So I will spend, a f let me just do it. It's a brasserie. I've got Potato. Well, I, I need that. I, it's got to be that. So, potatoes, tomatoes, cheese, meat, and baguette bread. So, I will build a uh, brasserie. Nice. Guess I'll go over here. Okey doke. And that gives me a bump in income of. Three. One, two, three. I guess that's it. Okay, mark your restaurant. Yep, but those are discarded. Wait, is that correct? Did I do enough? I missed the flour, I think. No, it doesn't need flour. Potatoes. I just want to make sure I'm not cheating here. Potatoes, tomatoes, cheese, meat, and bread. Okay, I did not. It's exactly correct. Okay. I, th I guess it jumps from five to seven. Sure does. I don't know. Yeah, Mark it. Yep. Yeah. And I just want to point out that if one more building is built... Yeah, we're done. That we're done, because that right. will be 11 restaurants out on the square. Yep. Let's take a cheese. Cheese. And this. I'm going to draw... The tomatoes. The tomato. Potato. There's a fishy fish. Yep. Then I'm going to... Build terraces. Let's see what I can do. Um, that's eight for these two. So eight. 
right? To three? Yeah. From 11? Um, that's those two. Nice. And that's the pizzeria. So I will put one on the pigeon. Pigeon. Pigeon and one in the front door. And take a pigeon card. Hey, anytime I want. Then the three, four, five, thanks to the pigeon card. That finishes that row. Cool. And I will put it right there. Cool. And that gets rid of that. And that's all of my... Mo money? Right? Yeah. Yep. Okay. I will draw a card. Um, From the top or what's on display? I'm looking here. I, you, took the, you took the tomatoes, which that is a bummer. Be what you need. I know, I know. Uh, here, just give me one off the top. That's Are fine. Are you sure? Yeah, it's fine. Okay, cool. I want it to look so bad. Yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> and then I will complete that one. I already have stuff around those lights. There's no more for either of us to grab unless we finish one in our hand, which we can't. So we are done with the public goals. Mm -hmm. And then I'll build terraces. So this is going to cost me six. That's on my brasserie. Take the pigeon. Take the pigeon. Is it fantastic? Wow, no, is it the tomatoes? I can you're... draw an objective or complete a second objective on your turn. Wow. Does they give you food on some of those cards? I don't no, think so. They don't. I think money is the thingy. Yeah. Um, and then I will build a, well, I can, I can draw an objective card, and it doesn't cost me anything, but it gives something potentially for you. <laughs> uh, let me think about that. No, because if you finish the game. Right, but that's minus points if it's in my hand. I won't be able to finish the game. I don't have, I can't build this turn. Mm -hmm. Unless I was able to wipe this out, which I can't, right? You have to finish two rows to end the game. Mm -hmm. um, and then I'll build this one for another eight. I'll do it over here. Get myself another pigeon card. Mm -hmm. Something good. Hey, build, place another terrace on that restaurant for free. Sweet. Is there something right there? Nope. Okay. And uh, that goes away. I was going to build that second one, and I do. Uh, the first one was six. No, no. I built th that. I built it all. I should yeah. double. It's not quite. So I did six, which is one, two, three, four, five, six. And then eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Did you bump yourself up in income anywhere? No. Okay. Oh, yes. There was one of these from that. All right. Um, but that's great. Then I only have to build that one the next round if I have another, if there's another round. And I have a little bit of money left, so I might as well build another one on my Friedery. I will build it right here. Yeah. And, uh... Killing that pigeon for both of us. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, Nikki? I actually just was tallying this in my head, and I think mm. I have one, my income, I must have bumped something somewhere probably on the last or the round before that. I don't think I've overspent uh, my, my resources, okay. but I think I'm on 16 because I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, plus four is 11, plus three is 14, plus two for the grill is 16. So I don't get to build that one. Okay. Let me put that back. Mm. And it's your turn. Knocking my pizzeria around, man. Oh, it was spinning. Was he just right there? Okay. Yeah. I'm going to take the fish. It's really hoping for a baguette. So, <laughs> because I don't have a baguette, the only thing, and there's no more grills available, the only thing I can build is a, a freight. Freightery? Yeah. <laughs> There's still three more. I have what I need to build a grill, but there are no grills available. Right. Everything else on, yeah. needs a baguette. And I, well, I guess I could if I don't care about terraces, I could build one of those. It ends the game. It does, and it would be more points. Maybe I will do that. Except for the one with a baguette. No baguettes. So, let's see, do I... All right, I will take another tomato so I can build. 
yeah, the pizza place. You just need two tomatoes and a, a yeah, flour. Yeah, two tomatoes, two tomatoes, and a flour. Yipes, okay. I know, well, it didn't, a, I ha, a baguette. Yeah, I, 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 I need a baguette too. It so. would have been nice to do that because um, building one of those two restaurants is a lot more Well, points. the grills are gone, so the only thing I build is bar of as well, and I don't have the baguette. It's not coming. All right, so. I could probably make a baguette with what I have. But <laughs> pizzeria, pizzeria. I should have to just use two. Pizzeria. Boop. Okay. Market. It is my... Pizza. I like pizza. You've got all the pizza. You've got all most got buildings all for the sure. Pizzas, and then I can build some terraces. I think, right, Marvin? Yeah, I still have terraces left for those locations. So this first one is three. One, two, three. I will put it er, in front of this one so I can get a pigeon. Maybe something wonderful will yep, happen. Yeah. Okay. Oops. Uh, earthquake. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Let's see if I can pull it off. <sighs> I can't. That's hilarious. I'll tell you what the card is at the end of the okay. game. Pretty funny. Um, and uh, another one? Another four. one for four. Okay. That gets me up to there. That mark bumps, your income bumps up. Yep. my iron income. I go right here. Nope. And do I have any coin cards? One, two, three, four. No, no, no. You, you're no? at four right now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you just spend all of it. Spend all. It's it's the end anyway. So another terrace. Yep. And I'll just put it. Right there. Okay. Then it's my turn. I don't think I'm going to get to build unless I draw something off the top here. Just give me one off the top. Maybe it'll be a baguette. I hope for you it Hold is. Hold it really hard. I'm uh, sorry. Nope, nope. Hey, and it's still <laughs> nothing. I can't build any of these things. Isn't that uh, ridiculous? <laughs> yep. Okay. <laughs> well, we've had flour. We could make baguette, uh, bri baguettes. Well, apparently you can't. So the first thing I will do is... The flour is used for something else. I will spend 12. Sure. So let me do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Woof. For that. That's 37 points just for that row. Yeah. Crazy. I, I was doing more on the flower beds here. So I'll just go right here. At least I'm in second place. Second place in a two-player game. And then I will spend two for this one. One, two, and that is on my, the only place your I can French build my freenery. Yeah, let will just go this way. That is, that's, your french fry place is annoying, by the way. Yeah. This is, you tell the people that are waiting I only was to able be, to do that because I had so much money from this stuff. You know what I mean? I was building a bunch of ones. Seated at the brasserie to go get yeah, a snack get at the snacks. free place because the brasserie is so and exclusive. It only has yeah. two. And then I will build another one. <laughs> I'll do another one terrace here. Not that it does me anything. And my final thing is I could draw an objective card or complete a second objective during a turn, which is really awesome if I had that earlier. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm very afraid. I, I think that I would have, I don't, it doesn't say anything about being able to discard it. And we don't really have any clarification on mm -mm. those cards. So I'm going to look at it just for fun's sake. Oh my gosh. Funsies. Uh, I don't think that would have been good for me, but it sure would have probably been good for probably. you. Probably. Mm, not quite. Anyway, so that's that. And I think that is the end of the game. Sure is. So let's score it up. Woo! So now we take our scoring score sheet. Pad. I got yep. a pencil somewhere. All right. And the first thing we're gonna score is the uh, building points. Let's add up your buildings. You have, have two for the fritterie. Uh, where do you want to start? Just the smallest one. Okay. There two. Two. Then we have. Two, uh, five grill. for the grill, that's seven. Okay, then this crazy one. Uh, that one is tw uh, 12, so that's 19. 
-hmm. and that one is eight, so it's 27. Lincoln has 27 in restaurants. Okay, so my restaurants, the pizzeria is three. Is um, three, and the crepes is, is three, three. So that's six. And the grill is five. That's 11. And the fr fruit de Mars, de Mars three. is three. It's 14. The frite is two. 16. The pizzeria is three. 19. Bar Vin Milan is five. five. So 24. Sweet. Yeah, 24. 24. Now we move on to your uh, terraces. terraces. Okay, so I have 11 and 28, that's 39. Okay. And 34, which is 69, 73. 73 in terraces. All right. For me, uh, terraces is 7. Okay. 26. So that's 33. 12. So 40. Five. Wow, that's no good. Uh, it's building these big ones, and it yeah. cost me a lot to do it, it right? It did. Um, then we are going to see what are these goals. Sure. Well, are. you definitely get the 10 for the flowers. Well, we pull this off. Yeah. You get 10. For flowers. Yeah, and I get four. Let's see. Lincoln gets four. Nikki gets 10. The next one is the side of the board. The That's West. Lincoln. Do you think I have it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 13. fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Sixteen. And you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, so I get ten for that and you get four. Four. Ten. And the last one, most, most buildings, restaurants. That's you. So you've got, yeah, most restaurants. You've got seven or something like that. Two, four, seven. Yep. Yeah. And I get four. Okay. Okay. And then objective cards. Okay. I have um, eight, eight, 11, 16. Lincoln has 16 objectives, points. And I have nine, 12. 12. Okay, well, here we go. Lincoln, you have 134 and I have 105. Yeah, oh wow, okay. Mm. I, I'm sure it had something to do with the big buildings. I mean, those are, yeah. those are super valuable. It's kind of weird, like when you don't bundle up with, when you don't pair up with resources, you kind of can't build some of these smaller ones. Um, yeah. they, they require multiples. All of these smaller ones, and I built none of the middle ones, and I wanted to build them, right? I mean, you know, obviously I would like, once you start to have too many of one thing, individual mm -hmm. things, you might as well just go for the bigger buildings. Well, and I built all the middle ones and none of the big high ones. Well, did you build one of each type? You built pizzeria, crepe, re, and, yeah, you did, fruit de mer. Well, all of them. I built none of those. Yeah. Um, what do you think, Nick? I like it. I still don't know what a clear uh, direction is uh, to win right. yet. I don't know if I should have built less restaurants or more restaurants, or I should have at least gotten one of these big, big ones in, or if it was okay to not, if I would have ended up the same way if I had built one of these big ones sure. or not. I don't know. It's I do a think fascinating they're worth it. game. Yeah, it's, there's definitely um, some different paths you can take. I thought for sure, I mean, you were building a lot of buildings. Yes. And you were building a lot of terraces. Once I started to bump my income up, I was able to build more for the ones that were important to me. And that one that, I mean, this was terrible for you, although you were able to fix it with that, that pattern mm -hmm. there, but this whole thing was terrible. Mm -hmm. But it helped me do the one where I drew f from the top of the stack, right? Mm -hmm. And I took, made the decision, I mean, it was worth four points, and I made the decision to try, which is three terraces in each quarter. And I'm like, well, I don't have much of a shot in that corner yeah. if I don't do that, because I couldn't really build here. I mean, I had that card in my hand, so these two options were okay mm -hmm. for me. Um, I probably should have done that so that it could give me, but you know, this was, I was getting over here to do this. Yeah, so, sure. I don't know. To be three on that side. So my last pigeon card that I laughed at was, um, you may open a restaurant using one less ingredient. Oh my gosh. And I couldn't do you it. You still didn't have it. And I still didn't have it. Yeah, because you needed multiple. Well, because I already spent what I had. Right. And then what I had left wasn't enough to make. Anything out of even it. Even if it was like, okay. Did what? you have a potato? You could have done at least a. You know, I did. Oh, yeah, well. You could have done a potato, uh, the fritery. Yeah, but 
Here, it, does, it only gives you three point, two, two points. Two points. Yeah. So I don't know, but I was laughing at that. And I was very focused on this. I'm like, okay, maybe I can build one of these ones that required a baguette. Right. Uh, wow. But I still couldn't do it. <laughs> <laughs> well, too bad you got it for that placement, I guess, because it would have been nice yeah. if you could have used it for one of the for the, bra uh, the brasserie. Even just one turn before, right? Because that's great. eight. Those are those are big points. Mm hmm And that's the I felt to compete with you, I needed to build that brasserie. Yeah. I mean, once the gast gastronomy is yeah. built, that's it, because there's only one of them. But um, I really wanted to build a. A brasserie because that's eight points. But my mine was almost as bad as your uh, your grill. I w didn't get that much. Uh, well, it's exclusive. Yeah, it is very exclusive. Yeah. There's not much. Uh, it's mostly <laughs> just drinking out there. All the fine dining's inside. I yeah, guess. Yeah, that's right. Um, I don't even know. I can't. I'm, logically, I don't know. I can't even re remember like a really fantastic restaurant with the uh, with the uh, terraces. But maybe there must be. I, I'm not, I'm just not thinking of it. I like. Um, that the game has different options for the um, for the goals for the goals. So every game, it's not the same goal, um, and that I like that the objectives are either these shape ones or these um, sectional ones. Or yeah, this or, was place all the terraces yeah. from one restaurant. That was pretty interesting there too. So that's neat, um, and I like I like those. I like. That it's not just one type of thing. There's a lot of different things you can do with it. Yeah, I didn't build any kind of stuff that was conducive to shape. This was the one that I had from the very beginning, and it didn't. Thankfully, I was planning for it to do something, and I, you know, because I wanted the pigeon or whatever that was yeah. something there, and this wasn't going to let me do that shape. And then I'm like, oh, but wait a second, I can just flip it around and do it. I like these a lot, and I like that there's negative mm -hmm. consequences if you don't take care of it. We could probably just look it up on uh, BGG, but we I would wish there was a, a glossary for... For the cards? Just in case for some interpretation. It mostly is mm -hmm. clear, but like I'd like to know for like the pigeon cards, these are actually not hard to figure mm -hmm. out. These are slightly weird, right? Like, it, do I get to keep that uh, and or put it out potentially for you to get... That was why I saved it to do it on my turn, so that if I was going to look... And then I dumped it, mm -hmm. you wouldn't be able to draw from it. But then I got nervous that I wasn't sure that I could actually even draw. But again, it was this shape, which I didn't have. You know, it's like a Galaxian shape or a, a Space Invaders. <laughs> um, let's do it that way there. Or so. a goal. So anyway, yeah, field goal. Um, but uh, it, it's really cool. And I, the, the little mean things are not great. I was not mm -hmm. exactly happy about doing this one. But mm -hmm. I had taken this one. And then that's what I said. After I took it, I said, uh-oh. Yeah, because okay. I realized, oh. This is going to be hard. I didn't have a restaurant over here, and I didn't have a restaurant over here, and I, I had basically these areas taken up, and I was going to just place here to get in this zone. I was like, oh, mm -hmm. I'll just do it here, cover up one or two of Nikki's, and then I'll be fine, right? And uh, then I realized, oh, I really am over in this corner. I'm in yeah, trouble. Yeah. So then I, I thought, well, I use that card and just go this way. And I only was able to do, since I believe it's only on one turn, I was only able to do all of that because I had enough money and they were cheap to be able to um, to get me into this area to do to, to do three. I actually kind of blew it here too. When you had the, you said the fish shape there, I was building to get this mm -hmm. and I had no more, Ugh. right? I could not, Silly. the grill was done. So I could have just done it now. I don't know that I would have gotten it, but right there would have given me that, right? And if I was just paying attention, because I said, oh, I, I can't even do it. But I could do it, but you could take it on the next round, which was a mm. smart thing to do because it's a public one and you just grab it and make sure I can't do it. Um, and I was done with it anyway. So I would have had to build, actually this is empty too. I would have had to, it's this row that actually kind of hurt me. <laughs> I needed to have, I so that I, because they're not too expensive, two, three, and four, right? Last one is five. You were going for big points though. I, I, that's well, where I, I don't wanted, know. I wanted to build these. Every <laughs> single one of these required two of some sort of okay. ingredient, ingredient and so, most of the time I did not have that. Yeah. Like, there was a real hard time where I wasn't getting um, flour, and then the cheese and the uh, the cheese and the bread. I think was the next thing I ran into a problem with. I was able to finally do it here. I think that I think that I had didn't have the bread. I it might have been potatoes and cheese. I didn't have there for a little while or something to finish that one. Um, but I really like how challenging it actually is to build that. You think. Uh, you know, I was always, I'm always nervous, like, is this really the way you play it? You can build one of these gigantic ones right off the bat, but you can build whatever you can afford to build. Yeah. Um, 
and I was going for income. I really wanted to, that's why I did the grill, which gave me two right away. And then the very next thing I did was the gastronomique, which mm -hmm. gave me an additional four. Um, I was going for the terraces and I actually qu didn't quite, even though this was crazy, but I didn't quite go as far as I'd hoped to go on that. Yeah, uh, my first um, restaurant I opened was the Friedery because I was immediately looking at what Close, I could yeah. build right away, yeah. but also the goal. Yeah, the goal. And I'm like, oh, the flower bed, yeah. the flower bed. So that was where my focus went. And it was very expensive to build these, right? To get, come yeah. here was, and I was hemmed in pretty quickly. You put one here. Didn't do this till a little bit later, but um, so I just thought that oh, I'll just I'll just take second place on that. Um, although you had 24 to my. 18? Six, 18. Mm -hmm. It's only a six point difference, but still. Um, I really, I think that there's actually some really things to think about here. There you, is. There's, there's some decisions to be made. I really appreciate that these cost a action. One of your action things yeah. to, 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 to redeem these. To redeem it, It yeah. almost, I mean, I would have loved to have had this earlier. Draw an, uh, draw an objective or complete a second objective on your turn because I had to spend, I had to do these all one one round at a time because I did not have enough. You have to draw a card and then you have two more things you can do. And I would almost always wanted to build terraces yeah. to try to get as far as I could because there was at least one round where I didn't build terraces. I, I, right. And I was like in the 10 or 12 space here, which meant a lot of potential terrace buildings. So, um, but I did max out on these, which yeah. is pretty crazy. Well, I mean, what's kind of funny is that they say you have three actions, but one of those three actions always has to be drawing a card. Yeah. So you really only have two. Well, the beginning of the game, you're drawing <laughs> more of those because you, you can't really build much. Right. Um, not getting, now I had a pretty great hand. I had like a three of a kind there to choose which one I wanted. Yeah. But we still weren't, like we wiped out flour pretty quickly, I think, right? Was that the first thing that we had three of? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And Oof. you were already like, ugh. Yeah. I needed flour. And we got a bunch of flour at the end of that deck. Yeah. So it was like a lot of flour at the beginning and a lot of flour at the end and I, barely anything, if not anything, in, in the middle. Right. What is the total count of cards on in the deck of each type? Well, you know, there's 48 of them, but they don't break it down in the rule book. So That's we weird. could go through it. That's weird for gamers, you know. <laughs> I, I know. mean, somebody will go through and count a it right away. A gamer will go through it. Now that you said it, I kind of, I've got a little bug that yeah. I want to go through and see, see what how it many is. Of each. I mean, these will give you the sure. additional options of having that in your hand. Uh, I didn't, I don't know, if, maybe I had one that had a baguette in it, in the multiple choice ones. I think I did. It just, there I didn't know. have it later. When so I really wanted, three. yeah, there's a baguette. Number three, cheese. Another baguette on the split there. Here you go, if you're-, if you're I'm doing turning. it, I'm doing it, okay. except I'm the tours. I want to see these. Was there any kind, I don't, we played this on the uh, Game Night live stream, and I was wondering if there was anything that was... I mean, these are great. Like, getting these is really great. You were actually getting a lot of these, too. I was. I did. I think I got draw two, te uh, draw two additional resources twice. You got that at least once. Yeah, the two, go two uh, right. Franks is great pr as well. Yeah, these are these are nice. I think that the little uh, I need oh yours. yeah, my additional cards. I'm if sorry. If we're doing this, yeah, yeah. Well, I still got a fistful, fistful of cards. Okay. Oh, there was no fish so far as a pile yet. Wow. So they're not equally split. I guess, or I had a lot more fish than I thought I did. Wow. Okay. Well, that answers a lot of questions. All right. So. A lot we, of potatoes. We have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight potatoes. We have one, two, three, four, five wheat, wheat flour, or flour. flour. Yep. Four or three. Three, three fish. fish. Wow. Well, that, you know, I separated I know, those I know. out. That's fine. Um, cheese, we've got five. Five cheese. Wow. Okay. Well, there you go. That's one reason yeah. why we didn't see them. Four. We have four baguettes. Nice. Not many meat either. Four. We have four meat. Yeah. Well, there you go. So those these are crucial to having a variety. Five tomatoes. Wow. And then I don't know how you want to figure I don't, this out. It's just just go and just fan them one, out so we can two, see them. One, two, three, four. There are four of, of the, the two. twos. Split ones. Okay. They only, there's no okay. seafood on any of no those. No seafood on any of those. And more potatoes, which aren't really necessary. And then we've got 
the three, there's only three of these. And there's two fish on there. Okay, well there's a baguette on each one of those. There's a baguette here and there's a baguette over there. Yeah. So there's not a lot of baguettes either. So, so that's why go. that's it's why we didn't see them even at all. Which is cool. I'm sure it's a mathematical reason. So there probably means that more frideries are built in a multiplayer game. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And coins. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven coins. coins. Oh. And they're always only just one in right, this right. deck. Right. Wow. And then the pigeon I got gave me two. two. Yeah. The board actually, as we mentioned earlier, the board mm -hmm. is um, a little bit different for the... All it is is just the size of it. And you can you can actually play on the other side of the board with the two-player game. Sure. I just felt that that would be a little confusing. Um, yeah. As far as... I mean, once you start building, it's pretty obvious. But they have lines to show you uh, where your... different player count boundaries are at. So there we go. Woo! I still hit... I guess it goes that way for north. Yep. Yeah, so you see each line, this is the two, this is the three, and this is the four. Right. So I just thought it would be a little bit... I, I actually, you know, of course it's nice to have it, the boundary look correct for the size, but you just, right. you just take out some of the street, that's all it does for that. Yeah, it does. And then the, the of course this right um, the different score the different breakdown. scoring first yeah. second third fourth oh wow so they're worth quite a bit more points yeah. actually well not look at that like in a twelve and twelve four player yeah. yeah interesting it's interesting that there is two it wouldn't have made a difference on the two fours that I got <laughs> right I would have lost eight and you would have lost four if mm. it seems like you shouldn't bother with the second player one it should be a race to the best right right in a two player game but I don't maybe it was bad like mm. it was bad because you could get squeezed out and you don't, you're in, that would be bad, I suppose, right. if you put resources towards it and then it was squeezed out so you couldn't do it. So that's where you would place start for the two for player. a two player if you wanted to play uh, right. on this side of the board. And then there's where it would be if you were playing a three. Interesting, so it's got, well, and it's just essentially that tree in the corner. And then here is if you're at a four. Yeah, no, I, no, no, four is here. Well, yeah, but I was just backing up. Right, I was just going to the edge, right? So well, the edge is here. For right, four. but this is two. Yeah. This is three. I was just backing up. And this is them four. Up. Right, exactly. but that's, yeah, that's what you would do just to do the corners. Okay. I, I think as far as two, that's about as crowded it's, as it seemed on our it board. It is, it's exactly the same. With yeah. not a lot of room in front. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, before you start That's interesting too, right? That's planters you, you, and If things. you're playing any more players, it's further to get to yeah. these locations. And there are only two lamps. Interest lamp posts. Mm -hmm. Interesting. That's kind of a dark uh, terrace there. Well, it's romantic. Oh, there's also these all on the corners. They have so. candlelight. That's right. On the terraces, Lincoln. Right. And car lights, headlights as they're coming yeah. around. Or, or and scooters. And scooters. La, la, la mobilette. La Re mobilette. I only know that, even though I studied French, but I only know that because of diva. Um, <laughs> well, thanks for teaching us, Nikki P. You're welcome. Thanks for helping out, Lincoln. No problem. And thanks to you for watching. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button and consider subscribing to our channel. If you click on the bell, you'll get notified when we put up new videos. See you next time. Bye.